So, Digital Technologies comes to a close. And we've been exploring how to prepare you as a teacher of digital technologies throughout this course. And with your final submission of your assessment, we've covered all the material that you need to hopefully be a successful teacher of digital technologies. Now, of course, as I've emphasized during uh, the last few weeks in particular, your learning will never end around digital technologies. There'll always be new technologies coming into play as we're seeing at the moment with artificial intelligence, but there'll be others as well. So you're going to have a lifelong engagement with digital technologies and learning about these throughout your career. And I hope to see some of you at various conferences and professional learning opportunities um, that occur during your career. And please come and say hello. And I always love to hear about how my past students are progressing and becoming fantastic teachers of digital technologies. So for this course, make sure that you've submitted all of your assessment. Two assessment items in this course. Hopefully you've definitely submitted everything for the first one. You've received your feedback and you've taken that on board and you've now submitted your second assessment item, your final one, and the results of that will be made available to you as soon as possible, but generally it takes a couple of weeks for that marking to be finalized. Um, don't forget to say goodbye to your peers in teams. You've been working together as a group and of course some of them you'll be meeting again in other courses but it's always nice to just um, make that final acknowledgement and i look forward to seeing you in the final tutorial <laughs>